take a look at this. This is designed to show gaps between any sales of the number of days. So you're going to see a min sale date over, we're going to partition by product ID, we're going to order by sale date. But here's where it gets a little tricky. So this is going to give you some great experience on how to really play with some of these numbers. We're going to go between one following and unbounded following. And as you can see here, we'll have a sale date. The first row is always a null in terms of date of next row. But then you see here's the date of the next row and there's only one day in between that. Here's the date of the next row. There's only one day in between that. If there were any gaps, you'd start to see, whoa, we didn't make a sale for three days? And that's going to become quite apparent to you. Notice that when we reset and go to product ID 2000, we've got our null again. But then again, it starts over with here's what we're going to expect in terms of when the next sale came in terms of gaps between dates. Here's the row underscore number. Take a look at this. I want a row underscore number, open print, close print, over, order by product ID and sale date. It's going to sort by that. Once the sort is taken care of, it just says, let me count the rows. One, two, three, and this is probably the most effective way to get that sequential number. Plus, you're going to see this row number out there to do a lot of clever things, so I want you to get very familiar with this. This is dynamite. Here's my row number, but it starts to reset. It goes 1 to 7, then 1 to 7. Why did it reset? It reset because of the partition by statement. Every time you see partition by inside an ANSI OLAP, that says you reset whenever you get to that new product ID. This lesson brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Need a query tool that makes joins easy? The Nexus has a join builder that turns the most complex joins into child's play. The Nexus Query Chameleon, making connections easy again. Visit coughingdw.com for more information. Hi, this is Tom Coughing. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please hit subscribe to make sure you are kept up to date on all our videos.